Hello everyone and welcome back to the next episode of my Discover Raja on Bud series. And today's dive side is uh, very close to Cape Cree, like I've mentioned before. It's actually just behind Cape Cree and it's called Cape Mansour. And there's a little village. It's quite easy to find. It's basically just a, a big uh, shallow reef area with a gentle slope down to the deep end, which leads to the village or the jetty. And the jetty is the big attraction on this dive side. When you get in on the edge of the reef, um, it tends to be quite deep, it, the gentle slope goes quite deep, but as you swim with the sloping reef on your left hand side, you'll see it gets gradually slower and shallower and shallower. Now on this dive side we quite often, um, of course we're going to see uh, black tip reef sharks, um, quite often we see also bumphead parrotfish, a big school of them tend to be here. There's been times that I've caught them sleeping when a big school just hovering around without them grazing, it's quite nice to see. And of course there's loads of other fish um, to see here, obviously some wobbegongs and then smaller creatures too. There's quite often that we find um, nudibranchs, peacock mantis shrimp and things like that. Now on this dive side it tends to be a little bit dark for some reason but of course as you go shallower towards the jetty it gets lighter and lighter. So you just basically follow the reef with your, on your like I said on your left hand side till you see the jetty on your left. Now the jetty is relatively shallow, it's only about 10 meters at the deep end. But before you go off to the jetty, veer off to the right and on the right hand side a little bit deeper. It's quite often over there that we can find even more wobbegongs and if you're lucky in the blue there might be some mabula rays swimming around and of course more sharks. And then once you're done there you head back to the um, jetty area which is absolutely incredible. It's really really beautiful. Now normally we dive there early in the mornings so by the time we get to the jetty you can see all the sun rays coming through the, the planks of the jetty. It's really beautiful, beautiful colors and there's tons of fish over there. We see Napoleons, um, giant trevallies, uh, giant sweet lips, normal sweet lips and loads of slap snappers. And of course Look in the sand, there's a lot of macro to be found here too. Um, there's different types of nudibranchs, there's a few pipe fish that we can see. And if you're lucky, you might even see um, the spearing mantis shrimps that are over there. Usually there's one that we found that's an orange one, quite beautiful to see. But like I said, I've tried recording some of these macro things with my GoPro, not very successful. So that's the dive map. Let's jump in and let me show you what it looks like underwater. My name is Jan and welcome to my world.
okay guys that was Cape Mansour hopefully you enjoyed it and um, yeah very cool dive site especially around the jetty you know I sometimes I think you know just jumping in at the jetty and spend the entire dive there will also be sufficient because there's a lot to see over there and that's about it for Cape Mansour if you join me for the next episode I'm gonna take you all the way to South Raja Ampat it's also known as Mosul so um, if you want to see what that looks like you know remember to subscribe so you can get notified when I upload the next video which will be in a few days hopefully about a week so until then take care see you next time